I'm demonstrating a DDMS W export tool I wrote that I found here using a Google search. I'll follow the link to this wiki page where I can either get the source code or follow a little bit easier download link and download the file, which is what I'll do by right clicking and saving to my desktop. Then I just drag the file from my desktop into my drawing and give it permission to load. And it alerts me that I probably should understand DDMSW before trying to do this. I've turned on the GeoMap command imagery so that you can see that this drawing is properly geo-referenced to the Arizona State Plains Central projection and I've drawn a crude watershed and time of concentration path. I'll use two commands to get these shapes into DDMSW. The first one will copy them into various layers and add data tables to the objects. Do I want to make rainfall, subbasin, land use, soil, are TC maps? Yeah, to all of them. I can toggle them off or on, but I will accept them all. And I'll continue to select objects. Select the TC map polylines. Well, that's this one. Select the area map polylines. Okay, that's this one. It's done. It made copies on appropriate layers for all those maps and now it's going to open in the layer palette a filtered list of those maps for my convenience. Now I need to fill out the data for my maps and the layer for the rain map is on. I can pick the one of my or the polyline for my rainfall area and go to the properties palette and I'll see that I've got some data attached. This is correct. It's major basin ID 0 and default rainfall. I'll also demonstrate it using the time of concentration. We'll turn that layer on, the rain off, and I have the time of concentration. I select it go to properties and I need to put in the upstream and downstream elevation. This is not a DDMSW tutorial so you need to understand what's happening here and what it's helping us with what we need here. Okay now we'll I'll fill out all the rest of them and once I've filled out all my data, I'm ready to export my maps with the DDMSW export command. Now this is a little tricky. I need to select a folder and there's kind of a clumsy way of doing that. Let's, let's make a directory called Tom and I will, it says select directory and add an arbitrary file name. So I go to the Tom directory and it's already got select.directory. I say save right there with Tom, my folder up there, and a fake file name there. Now it's thinking and working and doing stuff. Over in our file explorer, I go to the Tom folder and I see all these maps that are going to be used by DDMSW and that's what the DDMSW export tool does. Leave any questions or suggestions in the comments below.